distracted driving. Music that you're listening to, billboards maybe. Hair, makeup. Distractions now rank among alcohol and speeding as leading factors in serious crashes. Just two weeks ago, a driver on his cell phone caused a crash. He was coming like really fast and I couldn't move because there was a red light, but it turned green and the guy never slowed down for me. He might have slowed down if his eyes had been on the road. He hit me and once I got out of the car, he was like, oh, I'm so sorry. Um, when I looked up, like the light was green, so I, I didn't even see you there. Cell phones were involved in more than a quarter of crashes in 2012. The National Safety Council of Nebraska hopes to end this rising problem through education, advocacy, and outreach. When you're talking on a cell phone, you really are suffering from something called inattention blindness. So your field of vision goes from something back here to about a little, a little tunnel in front of you. So all of these things that are happening out around you are being missed by you when you're on the cell phone. You're seeing just a fraction of what you need to see to be a safe driver. Nebraska is one of only four states to have cell phone use while driving as a secondary enforcement. In all other states, it's a primary enforcement. We think it's time for Nebraska to catch up to the rest of the country. The effects of distracted driving can be lasting, dangerous, and even fatal. For the Omaha News, I'm Tierra Shire.